Haav Narvi sain Papa Versus Killer Thor Kamata from Nantes Venti Egg in this match with Ava. When this up with some Mus Plus and Marvus, this is pretty okay match. I'm going to give this match for the five stars. So call this match if it to be entered for the five stars. So much to the goals then. Between two mega legends and let's start with sign Papa Hvis for 1930 Egg and that in 1999 my rest in peace. He in the Provost in business. In the 60s, sign Papa Hvis about the Rothers and you can the stars for the 60s, that's Royer and 70s, sign Papa but still wrestling, he wrestled Dory Funk Jr. or Jack Briscoe and Pedro Morales and many more. Eight is same Papa was still wrestling, he wrestled Cut to Fivu Kaasen. Well, Stan Hansen was in the eight is an Abdul the Butcher and early 90s, Andre the Sand went, went to Japan and he, him and Jan Papa to them for me to attack him and they were really successful. Mid and late 90s, Sand Papa was lovely good to his career, so 1990X Sand Papa wrestled his last match. He died in 99, so my rest in pieces, one of the biggest against for all times. My personal favorite legend of pieces, coach his matches. And Killer Thor Kamata was born in 1937 and started food and seven my peace. He in 50s or 60s, 60s I really can't remember tell because some places said 50s of their places 60s. But Killer Thor Kamata I'm not the biggest fan. 70s, I'm guessing he wrestled Abdullah the Butcher and Dick Murdoch and 80s, Killer Thor Karmata was still wrestling, he wrestled Stan Hansen as of guessing. And then now the X7 Killer Thor Karmata wrestled his last match, so that's the story of Killer Thor, Thor Karmata, his one of the biggest against others, my personal favorite legend. And like any other business, so this was for the five stars seen better matches, but this was almost perfect match because so many, many different freshly moves and Sand Papa and Killer Thor Kamata. Kamata just became my favorite freshly and Papa I'm big fan of. So go this match if it to be entered a little bit everything to everybody. Submission moves, suplexes and beating, so and they, they were out of the ring and stuff like that, so I believe Thor Kamata won this match and the BWF Heavyweight Sampes. And well, it was an impressive match. For the five stars, like I said, and between two mega legends, the first against the biggest against all times. So yeah, for the first time, I'm going to say exit code since I'm still still free in YouTube for a watch it and All Japan Pro Wrestling Classic, they wrestled this match in Japan and this was for the PWF Heavyweight Champions. And it was a for the first time, match like I said, almost five times. And you won't be bored if you look this match, okay, but. Well. 